Okay, so for Grad Life cooking here, we're going to start low and work our way up. So we're starting off with this fine, delectable treat. You guys may have heard of it. Bagel Bites. Three cheese blend with um, a bagel and ketchup. And I don't know. Never had them in a while. And I bet it's going to be good. So you sound the instructions. You just put them in. Let them go. Just put them in. Let them go. There you go. That looks good. He's gonna be good. And look at that. It even comes with its own plate. I was I was the first child in uh, in my family's like friend group or whatever, my, my parents' friend group. Um, and so they never had kids, so like they didn't know like what to do with kids. So they would <laughs> go around when I was however however old you are when you like start word age, like whatever. you know, yeah, ten. Yeah. You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Eighteen. Yeah, yeah. yeah, ten, eighteen, yeah. Um <laughs> Woo. and um Woo, hey guys. Yeah. And Sorry. Then, uh, <laughs> stories over here, buddy. Yeah. Yes. Um, and so, uh, I guess like long story short, they got me to, like they got they would get drunk and then tell me to go like this and and say tits, and then I eventually did that and those were my first words. So so there's one night I don't know if there's any footage of oh me running God. around going like this and yelling tits, <laughs> and so tits was my first word. Best, like, and doing that. And I mean, best first word you could have had too. Yeah. Because yeah. it's like charming and not too not too crazy. It's a really good yeah. first word. And a know? great and a great like words don't mean anything because I clearly didn't know what it was. Yeah. And, it, was it, and it's like funny because it's like relevant. Too. Yeah. It's like relevant oh, to yeah, what yeah, you yeah, want. Yeah, you know? Because yeah, yeah. you're like, what does a kid want? Tits. Yeah. You know. <laughs> it's I mean, awesome. Well, are, are you still breastfeeding when you can speak? Is that a thing? Oh yeah. Do you see do you see those documentaries about about that English woman who's still breastfeeding her kids when they're like seven? Oh, oh they my can, god! Like, they that's can, like, that's do, terrifying. Like, like they can use the toilet, but like, you know. oh, like a I mean, like, I, 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 I mean, I guess like smoke them if you got them, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, guys. I'm wearing my gross boy shirt today. This is what I consider to be my gross boy shirt because I'm a gross boy, and I went shopping. Look at that, fresh direct. <laughs> That was delivered to me. Three boxes of I have no idea. Well, I do, but I forget. So it's stuff I know that I want because I ordered it, but it's, I forget what it is. So this is like, let's unbox a little bit. Just a little bit, okay? Uh, let's try this top one here. Let's see if I'm strong enough. I'm not. Here, come with me. I'm gonna hold the box and the camera at the same time. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Uh, need a stabby thing. Uh, ooh, random refuse stabby thing. <sighs> yeah, it's like Christmas whenever you decide you want to have Christmas because you just order food and oh my God, here we go. Okay, we got, <sighs> this is awesome. <laughs> Healthy, gonna live forever. Kettle cooked. Gonna live forever. Cranberry. Gonna live forever. Um, Multigrain. Ever. What is this? Listerine? <laughs> Hell yeah, that's awesome. Then we got um, pasta. Rotini. Gonna live forever. Uh, elbow. Chifuri. Gonna live forever. Uh, then we got Coke Zero, zero calories, gonna live forever. So that's just one box. I know I said I was gonna do one box, let's do two boxes. I kinda understand what Ricky is like now, he just wants to open stuff. <laughs> Tell me, are you, ooh, this one's considerably lighter. I guess there's no Coke Zero in it. Seriously though, this beats the hell out of shopping. I just did this all yesterday, it probably took like maybe 15 minutes online, and that's how I had to set up an account and everything. Basically, I just want to get hired as Fresh Direct's promotional dude and just make unboxing videos of their food. Oh my god. This is the deli box. Hold on one fucking second here. Oh god. Look at this. Rosa Mexicano. Chicken and cheese enchilada with ranchero sauce. Gonna live forever. What the hell is this? Bagged, bagged, bagged macaroni. Um, look at this, whipped, it's light butter. Gonna live forever. Go over here. 
And we got what? We got some cold cuts of sorts? Cool. What's this? Cheesy, cheesy? Oh my god, cheesy. Awesome. This is a great day. The problem is now is I need to hire a chef to come here to make it for me. Grad Life Cooking Show? We said we were going to try that, but it just ended up being grilled cheese for a while and that sort of petered out then. Presto! Italiano! Gonna live forever. Car little baby freight is coming along. Zero calories, zero flavor. Where'd that cheese go? Cheese goes. Cheese and butter aren't friends. The cheese and um, Chinese leftovers are friends, yeah. Number three. Yeah, there you. Yeah, there you. Oh, God. Mild and wild. Gonna live forever. Whoa! Awesome! Fucking piece of cardboard. So cool. There we go. We got a... Woo! I don't think I ordered this, but cool. I'm down. Then we got, um... Oh, head and shoulders! Shit! Gonna live forever. Why am I just opening this? <laughs> um, what the hell are you? This is weird. Check this out, guys. So I need somewhere to put this. Ooh, that sounded bad. I did not order this. Is this complimentary? Happy Valentine's Day, Semper Green Bibber. Wow, I think Valentine's Day already happened. <laughs> Thank you, though. I'm gonna go put this up here, or I'm never gonna see it again. I didn't want that. <laughs> what else we got? Oh shit! Yeah. Don't mind if I do. Right now, I'm gonna live forever, dude. My life's just gonna go on and on and on because I, like a lich, will just go on and on because I will have my gummy vitamins and I will be eating. Diet, no, Coke Zero and cold cuts with slow salt ham. They're children, so I don't know how many you're supposed to take as a big guy like me. So I take about eight. And there's two. This might just be a cleaning slash eat all the food I ordered in one day type of day. And resume build. Things like that. Productive, but not very exciting. I really need a job, but I really, I really want a job at which I got some headroom in, you know, like, because it's not hard to run out and just work at a restaurant and things like that, but like, man, it sucks because it, it takes away from what I want to be doing right now, which is seriously getting into like photography. Now, like, I make money, you know, doing stuff occasionally, but it's all, it's all hit or miss gigs. I need something that's dependable. I need to be working somewhere and I mean there's a few jobs I'm applying to right now and I'm definitely qualified it's just you know so I'll be in the one they pick and um, I do have that internship although I haven't heard from them yet so I'm again that's wedding photography so it's like you occasionally do it and when you do it you make a bunch of money but uh, as an intern you just kind of do it occasionally I suppose until they hire you full which they may or may not do we'll see eat them with your favorite fruits and vegetables ha! The container smells bad. Mm, but those smell good. Look at these subtle shadows happening. Whoosh. 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 Do you guys pay attention to shadows often in like film and stuff like that? Because I never used to until I started reading about lighting techniques and crap. And like, you know, you see them, but I don't really like think about where the light is originating from. But now it's like, all I can think about is where that light is from when I look at that. It's not a number on me. But look at how good these are. I am the disposable plate. I don't know, okay, I'm, I'm just gonna tell the vlog this, cause fuck. Uh, I, today, I, I tweeted something last night, if you guys follow me on Twitter, whatever, who cares. Um, but it was, a, I was up at like 2 a.m. and I was bored, and I was reading, uh, like, the black box, like, recordings, you know, for, like, airplanes before they go down, and shit like that. And they have, like, all, you know, everything that was said during the flight, like, the pilot's last words and stuff like that. So I tweeted something, I was like, oh, you know, this is what I do at 2 in the morning, hashtag sleep, or something. This is like some stupid fucking thing. And then it actually got featured because I think I hashtag sleep in it in the sleep comfort journal. <laughs> so there's all this stuff about like, oh, sleeping pills linked to whatever and stuff like that. And then there's just like my thing about how, I don't know, like pilot's last words. Calming relaxing shade of blue ideal for the bedroom. 
Last words, cockpit voice recordings, transcripts, air traffic control tapes. <laughs> oh boy, more fresh direct. Oh no, Grubhub. Yep. Oh, I got my fingers crossed. chicken salad. Oh, yep. Everything comes to you. It's so wonderful. Including Ricky. Ricky came to me. How you doing, honey? Good. Good. Two minutes and 30 seconds of pizza roll. This is the most variety of pizza we've ever had at once, I think. We have pizza rolls, bagel bites. Oh, you can order pizza. Oh boy. I didn't know you got bagel bites. I know, look at I got the bagel bites. They're so good. <laughs> it would be friend. Charles Turpy friend. <laughs> oh, I gotta expose this right. Hold on, you guys can't be seen yet. What the shit? It's too bright. Yeah, okay, there you go. Now you're now you're in there. Now you're flying. Now you guys are flying. You can't see the camera right now, but I promise you there's a camera in this room. Yep. Two more two cameras in this room. <laughs> wow, 570 people. You guys are hanging around. Usually it's like 600 people, and then like 30 seconds later, it's like back to 15 people because they realize how fucking boring this is. <laughs> but no, you guys are killer. Yeah. I love you all very much. Yeah, you guys should um, say get well Charles in there just in case. Like, he's never going to watch Grad Life, but just in case, you know. Yeah, no, he's, like, he's way better. Just than like that. any sort of vibe you can send.